Sai Ram pranams to everyone. We are today at the village of Nimon, which is about 35 kilometers from Shirdi. We have come to the house of a Mahabhakta of Baba. According to Hindu dharma, one gives Tulsi Tirth to a person in their final moments on this earth. Baba took Mahasamadhi on October 15, 1918. It is said in Sri Sai Satcharita that Bhagoji noticed that Baba's breathing had stopped and he immediately told this to Nana Sahib Nimonkar who was sitting below. Nana Sahib brought some water and poured it in Baba's mouth. We have now come to the house of Sai Mahabhakta Nana Sahib Nimonkar. During Ram Navmi festival in Shirdi, there are two flags that are used. One was from Damuanna Rasne of Ahmednagar and the other is from Nimonkar from Nimon village. Even today, Nimonkar's family provide the flag for Ram Navmi at Shirdi. There are other connections between Baba and this place. Shama or Madharao Deshpande was one of the closest devotees of Baba and was almost like a friend to Sai Baba. Just like Bhaktas approach Shiva through Nandi, Baba's devotees used to approach Baba through Shama. Shama was born at Nimon. This is the flag that is taken to Shirdi for Ramanavmi. This is provided by this family. There are photographs here. One is the photo of Nana Sahib Nimonkar and the other is that of his wife. There are many other significant items here. What we are seeing now is Baba's Udi. There are lot of other significant things as well. I'll go through them one by one. If Baba gives an item to someone, it means they are good at that. For example, if Baba gives kafni to someone, it means that they are good at discipline. If he gives headscarf it means they are good at keeping time in that manner baba has given padukas which are worn by sannyasis to only three people without them asking baba has given padukas of the type worn by sannyasis these padukas are made of wood baba has given one such paduka to nimonkar also this is the picture of nimonkar's wife and her son. We have read in chapter 12 of Sri Sai Satcharita that her son falls ill at Belapur and she wanted to visit her son for a few days. Next is the photo of Nimonkar. Baba has given Sanyasi Padukas to Nimonkar and two others. The other two devotees, those who got the Padukas, are Kaka Sahib Dikshit or Hari Sitaram Dikshit and Himan Pant or Govind Raghunath Dabulkar. So three Mahabhaktas got such Padukas from Baba. Wherever they go, they take the Padukas. In addition, they are carefully preserving the Udi given by Baba to Nimonkar. They have kept it in a Udi box. Once they find that there is a very little Udi in the box, so they want to fill it with more Udi. Suddenly, he gets an idea to take a picture of the box. In the picture, he was able to see Baba. Baba as well as Baba's Padukas and Satka. In one angle, we see Baba's face very clearly. In another angle, we see Padukas and Satka. In addition, they have the first edition of Sri Sai Satcharita published in 1930. This was published by the Sansthan in Marathi in 1930. He also talked about the mentions of Nimonkar family in Sri Sai Satcharita. Sri Sai Satcharita was earlier published in Sai Leela magazine chapter wise. The first edition of the book came out in 1930. He is now explaining how Nimonkar, his wife and the family is mentioned in Sri Sai Satcharita. 
The padukas are usually covered in silver for protection. On Thursdays they open it and we can take darshan of the wooden padukas and even touch them. We did not come on Thursday since they know us and we have come here before they opened them for us and let us take the darshan of the wooden padukas. Nimonkar was a judge at Sangamner. The British had given him a certificate or charter in brass. The charter says that Nimonkar can collect fines up to rupees 5. Imagine this, the value of rupees 5 more than 100 years back is worth lot more now. The British government has given the charter that he collects fine up to rupees 5 which was a very large amount at that time. This shows his stature and the trust government had in him. They provided lot of information like this to us. We are now going to take darshan of the wooden padukas covered in silver. This usually happen on Thursdays. Since they know us well, they are opening the silver covers and showing us the wooden padukas. Once they removed the silver cover, we got a very strong and pleasant smell of sandalwood. We felt very happy. to take darshan of the padukas and to touch them we have come here several years back and are very happy to take darshan and touch them the padukas were given by baba with his own hands to nimonkar these are padukas worn by sanyasis baba has given such padukas only to three bhaktas nimonkar is one of them the other two are hari sitaram dikshit and dabolkar Taking darshan of the padukas after several years was very very satisfying. This is a very blessed house. In addition to items belonging to Baba here, there is a samadhi of one of the Navnaths in front of the house. There are nine Navnaths, and there was one shishya to all of them. We are going to see the samadhi of that shishya. Look at this paduka. This was given by Baba to Nimonkar more than hundred years back. He and his wife were staying in Shirdi with Baba since nineteen zero eight, which is a big blessing. He got another blessing. He let final drops of water into Baba's mouth during his Mahasamadhi. This is the house of Nimonkar family. These are the padukas. they still bring flags to shirdi for the ram navmi festival the flags symbolize hindu muslim unity there are two flags one from the nimonkar family and the other is from damo anna rasne of ahmednagar this is going on well for so many years they bring the flags to shirdi every ram navmi we felt very happy here If you come to Shirdi you can see it during Ram Navmi during Madhyan Aarti they give the flags As I said this whole house is a blessed house another reason is that there is a samadhi of a shishya of Matsendra Nath in front of this house They are nine Navnaths and they had lot of followers and they were the shishyas of Navnaths The samadhi of one such shishya is here. This samadhi is very energetic. We felt very happy. We thanked Baba who gave us an opportunity to visit this place again after several years and do video coverage. There are earlier videos of this place. Those videos do not have good quality because we were not familiar with video coverage at that time. With practice, the videos are getting better. तेंगना अंदर लोग को तेलीवा रखा दे ये ना नम्मा का अपोला professional आ नम्मा केड़ के तेरी आ दे इप्पो कुंजो पढ़ा ही किटा दे नाले उंगल कोंदे reshoot पनी इंद वीडियो सोला तेरुंबर reshoot पने के टुकों आदले इन्ने की नम्मा निमोंड कर बीट के वंदर कोंगा ये लार कुम रोम्बा रोम्बा नन